Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm doing some shopping for my military ball outfit. I already have my dress. I ordered it off Amazon and it is gorgeous. I was super skeptical. Skeptical? That's not a word. <laughs> skeptical. Why can't I say that? <laughs> I was super skeptical about ordering the dress off Amazon because I couldn't try it on, but it worked out really well. It was 40 bucks and it's beautiful. So I need some shoes and I need some jewelry to go with it. So right now I'm here at Payless. I already know the exact pair of shoes I want. If you guys don't know, I am not a heel person. I will follow my face in heels, but there's a pair that I think might work. I found them online, but I really wanted to try them on before I bought them. So hopefully they have them in stock. And then I'm gonna go over to Charming Charlie's, which I'm obsessed with that store. Anybody else obsessed with Charming Charlie's? I just got a purse from there last week for like 35 bucks. I love it. Anyway, I'm going there for jewelry because they have like every type of style of jewelry you can think of and they're very um, well priced. So I'm going to go over there and then at the end of the day when I get everything and go back home, I'm going to show you guys what everything looks like together with the dress and the shoes and the jewelry because I'm not going to be vlogging at the military ball. So I wanted to show you guys like the final product of what I'm wearing. So let's see what we can find today. complete bust they were way too high like I was literally on my tippiest tippy toes there was no way but they were perfect except for the fact that they were way too high if they were literally an inch inch and a half shorter they would have been absolutely perfect so I didn't see anything else I really liked in there there was one other pair that I tried on um, but I wasn't crazy about them so I was really hoping this was going to be a short trip, but now I kind of have to start over. But there's a lot of stores here, so let's see if I can find another good pair. So I went with the shoes in Rack Room, the last ones that I tried on, but they were $50. I do not like spending that much money on shoes, but I just don't know that I'm going to find any others that close to what I want this close to the event. I did get military discount. Mill so hack. Always ask for military discount. Save me five bucks. So I'm still going to look though. I might return them if I find something else, but my shoes cost more than my dress. Charming Charlie's was a success. I always get a little overwhelmed when I go in there because there's so much to look at. Like they color coordinate everything, 
which is really helpful, but there's literally like 10 different sections of jewelry. So I was going back and forth trying to decide between if I wanted to do gold or silver. And I love pearls, so I was like focusing on the pearls and leaning more towards silver. And then I checked out, well, I was, on, I was in the checkout line and I spotted these earrings. Oh, she like individually wrapped everything. Is this it? No. I spotted these earrings like in the checkout line and I, she's like, oh my God, those are beautiful. And I was like, I kind of want to start over and then base my jewelry selection off of these. So I picked these up, obviously. Um, they're only six bucks and I ended up just getting them just for me for another time because what I picked out for jewelry, it kind of matches this, but not really. So, but I couldn't uh, turn away from these because for six dollars, like, I would wear these all the time. So I got those anyway, even though they're not for the ball. So what I ended up doing, the lady actually helped me and she spotted this. I told her that my dress was purple and she saw this and it's just perfect. I'm usually not a fan of rose, rose gold jewelry, but I think this is beautiful and my dress is a deep v-neck, so I think this is gonna look so pretty. And it's got a little bit of purple in there and that gemstone kind of looks pearlish and the chain is rose gold. It's, this was $12, so I think it's beautiful and it's gonna look really good with the dress. And then I found a bracelet to match it. It's kinda of tangled, hold on. So this is the bracelet. And it's rose gold as well, and it has like a rose gold pearl and a regular colored pearl, and then just some little jewels. And I didn't get earrings because I already have um, pearl earrings and they're more so like this color pearl so that worked out so I have necklace bracelet and earrings so that's done and this was $12 as well so not bad at all if you guys have a smoothie king near you get the peanut power plus the chocolate one because I think you can pick chocolate or strawberry with the peanut power plus chocolate one with yogurt mm. this is pretty much the only thing I get at Smoothie King if you like chocolate or Reese's this is amazing and it will fill so you I up I just left uh, Marshall's because I thought maybe they would have shoes for a little bit cheaper than what I paid and they did for sure but not my size like they had the perfect pair but not for my big old feet so and then, what was the other shoe store I went in? Ross. Ross actually had some decent nude colored heels. But they weren't like matte, they were like shiny. I just don't prefer that look. I like the more matte um, look. I don't like the shiny heels, so. And I don't think they had any in my size either. So, I'm sticking with the expensive ones, but. I mean they're very cute and this is as high as I will go and have gone in a long time but they are originally $60 and with um, they were on sale for 50 and then with my military discount I paid 45 so it's not bad not as cheap as I would have liked but not bad so now I am gonna head home and let's see what it all looks like together Okay, I'm back at the house. I'm gonna show you guys how everything looks. I really, really like it. So this is the dress. It does drag just a little bit. Right now, it has two layers. So the bottom layer is perfect. The top layer does drag a little bit, but that's part of the style. But I am, I am getting it hemmed tomorrow, so it shouldn't drag. It should be perfect tomorrow. But I love the deep V cut. It has it in the back too. And I believe this brand is called Ever Pretty. I will link it down below. Um, like I said, I got it on Amazon. It comes in like 20 colors and it's so comfortable and beautiful. I can wear a regular bra with it and you can't see it at all, which is a big plus for me. 
So $40 dress. These were the shoes from Rack Room, originally $60. I paid $45 with discounts. And then the necklace was from Charming Charlie's and it's $12. And I think that purple gem goes really good with the hue of the dress. And then the bracelet, also $12 from Charming Charlie's. And then the earrings were already mine, so that didn't cost anything. So total cost, $109. I think that's pretty good considering most formal dresses cost more than that by themselves. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching the Military Ball Shopping Haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Keep a lookout for pictures from the ball on my Instagram. So if you don't follow me already, head on over and follow me on there. And please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you're new and I will see you next time. Bye.